Finally, I have completed this volcano mountain. If you guys want to see how I built it, watch this video until the end. I will show step by step. This is where the soda or the flask stay. For the first experiment, I will use the Diet Pepsi and the Mentos. It's easy to clean it up and ready for the next use or you can store it away. First we need to make the frame like this and glue it on on the plywood. Base is ready. You can carry it from both sides. To make it more durable, I fixed it with some screws. Next, we need a tabletop for the flask to stay. And a four legs to make a little table. These legs are 16 inches. Glue it on together. Looking good so far. And now, make two more mountains here. It will be round. To make it more stronger, I put some screws here. Of course, this is going to be height compatible for 2 liter soda or a small flask like this. I will make an adapter for the flask later. Next, cut half inch white hard paper. Since the flask mouth is more wider, I will measure the ring for the flask. The ring stays up here and I will connect it down here. Looking good so far. And it goes like this. Now time to cover it up. We need a belt to hold it up for now. Cut the excess here. Here will be the gate. It is coming together. Now I will cover up the open spaces here. The door will be like this. Insert a metal wire. It helps to adjust the shape. The main mountain is almost done. Now time to make the sub mountains here and here. Make a small cones from a cardboard. Trace the excess and cut it. and then fix them on on the base. Now that these parts are fixed, we will glue on some leaf papers. We need this aluminum foil to cover it up. This will make the mountain waterproof. Actually, we need to start covering up from down to up. That's because when the liquid is poured, it goes over, but does not go down inside. Here it is, the mountains are covered. I will cover the base now. This is 
what it looks like so far. The door opens like this and the flask go in there. It's lightweight and easy to carry around. Now time to spray paint. First I spray dark grey. On the bottom part I will spray the dark green. It will give the forest effect. Next I use the brown or flat red color where the lava comes out from. It will give burnt effect. For the snow purposes I use the white spray paint. With the red color Time to make some lava lines. Here we go, the finished product. Down here is green like a forest. As we go up, there is rocks, snow and lava coming down. On the next video I will make some volcano on these two. The flask goes in like this. Since it is shorter, I made an adapter to put underneath. Then close the door again. Finally, I have completed this volcano mountain. This is where the soda or the flask stay. For the first experiment, I will use the diet Pepsi and the mentos. Our first experiment did very well. It's easy to clean it up. And ready for the next use. Or you can store it away.